The Nigerian Senate on Tuesday urged the federal government to, as a matter of urgency, take measures to fight the current food insecurity in Nigeria. The upper chamber also urged the executive to outline measures to combat the situation and address the people on steps taken. This resolution was reached after a debate after a debate on a motion sponsored by Senator Sunday Karimi representing Kogi West, co-sponsored by Senate Chief Whip Alin Dume. Presenting the motion, Senator Karimi noted that the price of goods and household consumables have been on abysmal rise in the country. This, he said, has led to a high rate of inflation, weakened buying power, and general was generally worsening the living conditions of the vast majority of Nigerians. Effort made by the current federal executive to arrest the con consistent increase in food inflation have not yielded the desired result. There is need to be more pragmatic about addressing food insecurity, curbing other farmer crises, kidnapping for ransom and terrorism, and ensure the de development of a viable national commodity board to regulate the prices of gain, grains and ensure the elimination of artificial contribution to food and commodity inflation in Nigeria. In his contribution, Senator Ahmed Lawan stressed the need for Senate leadership to engage the executive immediately to ensure food flood in Nigeria. Worried about the situation, the federal government on Monday announced suspension of taxes on imported food items, a move Senator Ahmed Lawan believes should be thoroughly examined. The other effort by the federal government is the provision of fertilizers to farmers across the country, something some senators said is yet to reach them and their constituents. On imported food stuff, Mr. President, here's the catch. This Senate must engage the executive immediately. What are the issues, which taxes are they talking about? Because we should be seen to be doing the right thing. We have really little or nothing in our food reserve across the country. And nobody should come and tell us uh, they will distribute food stuff from our silos. The silos are empty, Mr. President. So it means we have to import food. And if we have to import, it means we need foreign exchange. And that is because we have to engage with administration. We government must be entirely responsible because we cannot, we cannot take people for granted for too long. In a remark, President of the Senate, Godswill Akwabi, expressed concern over the rise of food insecurity in the country, adding that the federal government must find a solution to it. The Senate subsequently compressed all prayers into one, urging the federal government to swiftly address the food crisis in the country. Well, for me, I'm saying that this is an emergency. The food situation is an emergency. We must help our people. And part of it is also to make sure it's not just providing food today, it's being able to plant to make sure that latest October, November, we have excess food in the market because Nigerians must feed. Everybody's concerned. The primary role of government is to ensure the welfare and security of the citizens. And that is the reason why we are here. We must take emergency steps. The government is doing its best by ensuring that any food item that enters the country, zero levy, in order to make sure that people have food. And then, of course, the distribution of these fertilizers across is to enhance production, at least within this period, because after this, they will be useless. So let us make sure that these things are there between now and next week so that we can distribute to our constituents. And we shouldn't keep them. As soon as they come, distribute them. Let the farmers make use of them. That we should urge the federal government of Nigeria to, as a matter of urgency, take measures to fight the impending food insecurity. Outline measures, outline measures to combat the, the situation, and thereafter, 
address the, the Nigerian people. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.